stronghold. I will slow the guards. Now go! Until I change that, I should not regroup with Ali. The risk is too great. Poor likeness. They are looking. I have delayed long enough. I should find Ali and see what we can learn about Al Ghul. Peace, friend. Welcome, welcome. May I see your wares? Here's what I've got. Thinking of refining your gear? All right. Never leave home without some. Excellent choice. Have a gear improvement project in mind? Nothing further. I have to go. Please come again. I'm going to go hunting. You're welcome to join us. He's going to keep out. Oh, 
Ali. Credit where it is due, for this man came to my aid at my darkest hour. And from what I have heard, I am not the only one. <laughs> I will pay a great tribute to you in a chronicle of our exploits. But we must first write the end of it. Come. I see you two have met. Only briefly. But the night is young and there is much to discuss. About what you can procure for me. Our means are limited. But rest assured, I will listen to your needs, Ali. Later. Share what you know about al Ghul, so that Basim may do what he's come here to do. Yes, yes, yes. Your affairs before mine. But just this once. Al Ghul sends orders to the prison guards detailing where to dig around Baghdad. But it's not just prisoners he's using. There is a promissory note for workers here. It looks like Al Ghul arranges to purchase migrant laborers as well. Who in Baghdad could make these sorts of arrangements without raising suspicion? There is but one man, Masoud Al Yaqub. He runs Baghdad's soap mills. Finds paying work for foreign settlers, most of them Persian. So he forces these laborers into working his dig sites, all under the guise of providing them with a livelihood. Meshi! <sighs> he tracked down one of Al Ghul's dig sites, posed as a prisoner. What happened? The search turned up nothing, but that did not stop the guards from trying to silence us. I cracked one skull and fled. I doubt the others were as lucky. A foolish thing to do with nothing to show for it. Not nothing. Harun will be at the Karawan Sarai. I overheard the guards talking. Of course. Merchants from all over stop there to rest. If Mas'ud is buying migrant workers, it is likely the Karawan Sarai is where he conducts his affairs. What does he look like? He is a large man. Favors adornments like jewels and silks from the east. Then he will be hard to miss. It is time, Basim. What is your plan? That will be for Basim to decide. Basim? Alone? No. Let me gather some men. And allow for foolish spectacle. Your day to display your prowess will come. But this day belongs to Basim. Consider it part of our agreement, Basim. I am ready. Then walk with me.
Come, Basil. 